So, a change along's coming out. It just actually came out, and it is aircraft engine fire extinguishers. So, in the uh, upcoming major update, War Thunder, uh, in the upcoming major War Thunder update, we plan to introduce fire extinguisher systems for planes and helicopters. Um, blah, 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 blah. Default is six on your keyboard. Toggle fire extinguisher. You'll have a chance to come on. Let's see here. So there are two types of fire extinguisher systems for aircraft engines: automatic and manual. We will introduce a new modification for to the aircraft modifications list, which is called EF. So no, <laughs> uh, no, no free FPE for planes. Apparently, depending on the fire extinguisher's type, automatic fire extinguishers are activated with the destruction of the capsule with the fire. Firefighting agent by extreme high temperatures during engine fire. Occurring during engine fire. Manual systems are activated by pressing the tall of fire extinguisher. Default button is six. Once the system is activated, it may take a few seconds to cease the fire, which will make the engine inoperable. During this period, it will not be possible to restart the engine. However, it can help save the aircraft. You have a chance to come in on a Come in on a wing and prayer and a prayer to the airfield, or continue the fight, especially in the case of multi-engine aircraft. After re re repair, after the repair at the airfield, the engine will be restored. The same fire extinguisher for making it available again, uh, unlike um, regular aircraft where you can't, uh, regular tanks where you can't. Um, well, like tanks, if you land, you don't get. If you don't, if you don't, if you go to a cab, you don't get your fire extinguisher back. But for aircraft, you will get your fire extinguisher back. So, in order to avoid accidental toggling of fire extinguishers and shut down the, fl the engines in flight, the activation of fire extinguisher system is possible only in the event of a fire. In addition, you can also disable the fire extinguisher before the flight if you decide not to use it in combat for some reason, just unchecking the checkbox modifications list. Uh, blah, blah, blah. So, uh, list of aircraft A 10, all versions, Harrier, all versions, Aviate, all versions, F F 14, P 61. All ver so uh, F-14, a early vert, uh, God, I'm so stumbling it. P-61, all versions, A-26, all versions, TU-4, P-29, B-17, all versions, PB-4Y, all versions, PBJ, all versions, B-24, all versions, B-26, all versions, B-25, all versions, MiG-23, all versions, SU-22, all versions, SC 17 all versions, SC 7 all versions, Q-5, all versions, F A 5 c all versions, J-7, A-5. Uh, A5C, J7, all versions, MiG-21, all versions, MiG-19, all versions, Yak-38, all versions. A uh, list of helicopters, uh, Tigers, all versions, A129, all versions, uh, A109, AD-205, uh, Lynx, all versions, uh, YH-64, H-64, all versions, H-Mark-1, H-Mark-1. H1, all versions, UH1, all versions, K29, K50, K52, MI24, all versions, MI35, MI28, all versions. So basically, most helicopters are getting them, not the Alouettes and some others, but you will also have, uh, for, for a lot of strategic bombers that will die to fires, and but also jets like the F-14, where you've got two engines, or the Tu-4, where you have got multiple engines, B-29, B-17, you know, all the long-range bombers, the A-5s and the Q-5s that have two engines, uh, that'll be good. MiG-19 especially, uh, another one with two engines. So yeah, it's just a nice little change to put out your fire and not die. <laughs>